Hi, I'm Dr. Shadler. I'm the Associate Dean for Student Services and Admissions at Lincoln Memorial University's College of Veterinary Medicine. Lincoln Memorial was granted a letter of reasonable assurance from the AVMA in July 2013. I think it's important to note that the AVMA does not grant these letters lightly. They've examined our program quite thoroughly, inspected our facilities, visited with our uh, faculty members, and are very happy with what we've presented to them and have granted us this right to admit our first class. We are currently in the process of interviewing students into our first class, and once that class is admitted, at that point we will move to provisional accreditation. We will have provisional accreditation for the next four years, and hopefully that will lead to full accreditation four years from the time we take in our first class. With provisional accreditation, I know many students have concern about what happens when they graduate from our program. In direct communication with the AVMA, we received the following information. Graduates of an American school with provisional accreditation are qualified to sit for all veterinary licensing examinations. So our students upon graduation will have the ability to sit for state licensure and the ability to become a doctor of veterinary medicine.